been uh, three months, I think, now since I posted any meaningful content on YouTube, uh, and definitely probably eight weeks since I posted anything on Spotify and all the other podcast streaming services. Now, there's obviously a reason for why, because uh, I pr promised myself and promised the channel and promised everybody that does follow the channel so far that I was going to drop content regularly and there was loads of stuff coming and it's all very exciting, which is all true. Um, but there's this fine balance between being a perfectionist and having a ton of stuff going on in the background. I have mentioned this before on the podcast, but I will talk about it now. I've been doing a bachelor's degree for the last seven years. Um, it's a bachelor's degree in STEM that focuses on business management, innovation, environmental management, uh, strategic design, safety critical services, all the amazing stuff that I kind of, that supports my day job as an aviation engineer um, and as an aviation manager, which is great, right? But the last year of your degree is intense. It's really intense. Um, so there's been tons of stuff going on as well. But the bit that I've always promised myself is the quality of the content must get better, right? Every time I drop something, it must be a little bit better than what it was before. And I knew that by doing sort of half small versions of things, dropping small bits of content, it just wouldn't, it wouldn't make me feel good about what I'm doing. So I chose, I made a decision to focus solely on finishing my degree. And thankfully, thankfully, uh, as of uh, three weeks ago, that was my final submission was in. My degree is finished. Um, so that means that I can start focusing back on re-engineering again. So this is why I'm going to drop a little teaser now so you can see what sort of things are going to be coming. So let's take a look at the first bit then. So we've got, uh, let's break, break it back down into those core things that we're going to do or that I was going to do as a, as a podcaster or a YouTuber. Uh, Rem builds. So that, as, I, as I'm you can't see if it's off camera, is my uh, Porsche 981 Cayman um, Outlaw. It's been featured so far in, uh, on Frank Cassidy's channel for Nine is Unplugged. Um, I'm really proud of where that's come. And in, since if you follow the channel so far, you've barely seen anything of this car. Um, and I'm gonna go way deeper into what I've done so far. I, for now though, I head over to uh, Frank's channel, Boxing Gas, Nine is Unplugged, and you can watch a kind of 20 minute version of his, his kind of take on, we chat about more about what I've done so far with this car and what the future plans look like. Naturally though, I hate a few things because why would I share everything with Frank? Um, he's got his own channel, he's got loads of amazing stuff. There's loads more that's coming with this car. So, so that's the Rem build stuff. The, uh, the 550 project itself, and now that's taken, um, I've spent a lot of time thinking about that project and how I'm gonna move forward with it. The balance between uh, building an audience and having, an attractive place for sponsors to put money into um, and also making progress with that car at the same time. So loads of thinking has been done, not a lot of progress, but then naturally, as I've just said before, we've been working on a degree in the background, of course, it's going to take a little time. Heritage. Started shooting some Heritage episodes, really proud of those. Uh, I've got loads of kind of ongoing conversations with people about going to see their cars. If you have an older car from the Porsche era, if you've got something, if you've got it, especially 550 or a 718 RSK, either of those cars, let me know. I'll come anywhere. I'll fly out to you. I'll, I'll drive to you. I've got a couple of organized trips to um, the States next year that I'm going to be following up. Um, and I'm really, really happy with the way that's shaping up. But there can always be more. So if you've got an early car, if you've got a 60s, 50s, 60s, 70s car, let me know. Um, I know nothing. I'm an idiot when it comes to that stuff. So I really, really want to learn from you. And that's what heritage is. It's a ask me anything, idiot's guide. You, two, the, you guys teach me about this stuff because I just don't know. And actually, if I'm going to build a 550, but it's going to be a 550 on steroids, I don't want to lose what makes a 550 a 550. So there's an open call to you guys to let me know if you've got something you want me to come and shoot with you. I will do it. So that's Rem Builds, the 550 project and heritage. Um, what else we've got? Waffle. Waffle is, I'm pretty happy with the way that's shaping up already. You know, it's just bits of chit chat with me and friends, people I've met along the way on this Porsche journey. I love it. Um, it's probably the most simple and easy thing to turn out for you guys. So there's regular content dropping. I don't see really any need to change that. There's already loads of stuff. The only addition I would say is um, I've launched or starting to think about launching um, your Porsche stories really small bits of uh, content that will go out on the podcast mainly. If there's an opportunity to go out on the, on the YouTube channel, that'll happen as well, but chances are just be for the podcast. 
Um, and that is five or ten minutes just you talking about how you got to Porsche, what your Porsche is, or your story, um, any interesting anecdotes or things you've got to talk about, um, any plans you've got for the future. If you want to be in an episode of that, again, sling me a DM, head over to at Engineering UK on Instagram, at Engineering on Facebook, or drop me an email, um, and I'll put the details below. And you can jump on that as well. I've got a few lined up, there's a couple already out now. There's loads of stuff that's been shot already that just needs to be finished off and put out there. I'm going to leave you now though. Thank you ever so much for watching this bit. I'm going to leave you with a little sizzle reel of, of me and my 981. Um, well, I have, and very thankfully, have two film students that are helping me shoot all this stuff from here on in. So there's lighting now, and there's a, I've got a mic, and I've got a decent camera set up, and for, hopefully for the future, that will get better and better. But for now, thank you ever so much for watching. Don't forget to follow and like this stuff. It makes a massive difference. Rat Engineering, Rat Engineering, at Engineering UK on Instagram, Facebook, and if you head over to Spotify or any of your podcast platforms, you will find us there as well. Thank you so much, and I'll see you soon. For me, it was it was completely impossible to get anywhere near the idea of owning a Porsche. It just seems so far fetched. But the brand itself, I really bought into, and I've never lost that passion for it. Thank you.